Caspa will hit 10 cents sooner than you think. Hello everybody, welcome back to another video. I'm Chris and today we're about to analyze what happened since yesterday in the price because we are moving exactly as I was expecting, like sideways. We are forming here a bull flag as I told you yesterday. So today we're about to analyze this current situation. I'm going to update you what's going on with the market cap, with the rank. Uh, we are about to see the hash rate, the addresses. Also, guys, we are about to speak for something interesting uh, because if you follow me on Twitter, you have been known that I'm speaking that Casper's scalability on a mainnet is superior than the scalability with the, with the help of layer twos. Okay, so I will give you some examples why uh, it's better. And obviously, we're gonna speak for the Huobi listing because. CMC coin market cap playing dirty games and you're gonna realize the differences within centralized authority and decentralized authority. So uh, we're gonna analyze why coin market cap actually has not put us where we should be, okay? Because they have ranked us uh, in both 200 uh, from uh, the coins and we should be approximately in the rank 47 according to the coin gecko which is more reliable that's why i believe that for me at least for me coin market cap has lost my trust okay it's not trustworthy anyway so in this video we're about to analyze all of these things and if you would like to know all of these things all you have to do is to remain until the end of the video and before we continue i would like to clarify you that i'm not financial advisor whatever that you are going to see in this video is my own personal opinion my personal approach always do your own research before any kind of financial investment and guys if you are a caspa enthusiast caspa holder or caspa investor i recommend you to subscribe to my channel because daily i upload caspa videos where i try to educate you and inform you with the latest news in the market so it's going to be very beneficial to you for, to have all of this data by first hand and also guys do not forget to check my patreon group because here you're about to find my private telegram community where you're going to have access to speak with me 24 7 you can ask me absolutely everything any question any concern i'm going to be there for you to reply that also in that group you are about to find multi-millionaires lots of guys with very high knowledge and also recently we have got youtubers crypto youtubers and all together we have built a very great atmosphere and simultaneously you're going to have access to my crypto portfolio you have you're going to see how i handle my crypto portfolio because I'm crypto investor since 2016 so I have got some uh, experience behind my back and I can help you to prevent mistakes uh, it's gonna be very helpful for you to, to see how you should handle a crypto portfolio from an investment side okay not I'm not a trader I'm an investor here and also you're about to find my buy signals, take profit signals and sell signals. And guys, the sell signals are going to be very important by the bull run of 2025. And I recommend you to subscribe now because at the bull run or at least at the beginning of the bull run, I don't know exactly when, I'm going to rise the prices a lot because it's going to be unfair for the people who enter now to actually be benefit um, the same as for the people who are going to enter later. Okay, the prices at the peak of the bull run where it's going to be the basic phase of actually sell, okay, and take profits. Um, it's going to be like 10 times or even 20 times bigger the month uh, rather than now. So it's going to save you money if you enter now and actually uh, save and lock that price forever. Okay, anyway. If you are looking to build connections, to have fun, to upgrade your knowledge and uh, obviously make gains, this Patreon group is for you and I'm waiting to see you there. And without losing more time, let's get back to the video and start analyzing and actually I'm going to update you with what happened since yesterday in the Caspa price. Caspa right now is starting approximately where it was starting yesterday, 0 0.038 cents, rank 47 and the market cap is approximately 800 million market cap which is very strong as you know and guys is still a big steal okay <laughs> because under 1 billion caspa has very big discount and i recommend you to buy before caspa reach 10 cents because as, as you can clearly see the title the 10 cents will happen sooner than you think okay when caspa is going to be listed in uh top tier exchanges like one or two 
uh, we don't even need to see Caspa in all crypto exchanges to see Caspa above 10 cents. When we're going to see Caspa in like uh, two very big exchanges like crypto.com or exchanges like that, I'm not even speaking for Binance and Coinbase, guys, Caspa will explode furthermore to the upside and I believe the next target is going to be the 10 cents after this explosion okay we're gonna get very very close to the 10 cents i believe caspa will reach 10 cents before the bull run okay maybe even more maybe even more than that before the bull run starts so uh that's what i would like to tell you the rank is 47 so you can clearly see that we are standing very very strong to our competitors and without being backed without having help by no one not even by the coin market cap they don't even uh, put us where we should be, okay, in the rank 47, 46, uh, or even uh, higher than that, as I can clearly see. We are approximately 800 million, and um, we should be approximately in the coin market cap at 44, rank 45. Anyway, guys, uh, let's move on into the technicals because you can clearly see uh, that here we have got a uh, very very bullish situation we broke here the resistance of this downtrend movement and here guys as you can clearly notice we are forming a bull flag as i told you yesterday i told you that uh maybe we're gonna have a formation of a bull flag and guys i believe it's gonna happen like that we're gonna move here and there is a big probability to come here and retest the support of this huge uptrend movement and we can bounce okay there is a big probability to bounce and break a significant resistance which we got rejected here and i had also predict you that the 0.042 cent is going to be very hard to break okay it was previous a very very strong resistance you can clearly see also we got rejected here so i told you if we're going to break that we're going to get higher if we won't we're going to get lower and going to consolidate here as it's happening so Let's see how we're going to um, move here, I believe, with a consolidation phase uh, because the current situation is looking extremely, extremely bullish. Okay, that's why I, will, I, I always uh, tell you to do not rely on technicals, fundamentals are stronger. Here we had this head and shoulder pattern that right now is invalid. Okay, so uh, fundamentals are always stronger. Put this very well in your mind. And let's move on in the hash rate. Has rate for a couple of minutes, it was approximately 19.5 petahas per second. I don't know if we reached the 20 petahas per uh, second. Let me know that down below in the comment section. But definitely we saw an all-time high in the 19 point something uh, petahas per second uh, area. So um, that's because the... ASIC miners plugged in into the system. So uh, that's very, very great for the stability and the health of the network. We need these ASIC machines to have better protection. Okay, and from the addresses, guys, nothing significant changed since yesterday, not even in the top addresses. Uh, only mixing with true or sold again a couple Caspa coins and it's back in a position of 700 million caspa uh, coins and kucoin is actually right now the first top holder without actually having any significant move in their wallets okay and you can clearly see get io is going very close to flip mixi and be in the second place so uh, that's what i would like to tell you from the addresses we didn't saw any uh, crazy change and let's move guys into something that i would like to speak with you which is uh the scalability and many people consider and especially the bitcoin max is that we don't need caspa to scale because bitcoin has a solution for scalability which is a layer 2 with bitcoin lighting network uh, like ethereum has the layer 2s to scale and i have made a tweet here before a couple uh, days and I spoke for that Caspa scalability is on a mainnet. Caspa doesn't need layer twos to scale like BTC and Ethereum and as lots of other cryptos. And when we speak for global adoption, scalability in a mainnet is not even comparable to scalability with the help of layer twos. This is a big W for Cas. I made this tweet like a couple days before. And also today I saw this tweet, which is 
very interesting and this is um, a proof why scalability on a mainnet has no competition especially in a global adoption okay if global adoption will come we will need scalability on a mainnet is far superior okay uh, rather than have a mainnet and actually bridge that mainnet with another uh, network and have scalability through the other network uh, because the bridge all of these things are complicated and we can have some flaws uh, while we're going to have the global adoption so the global adoption maybe is not going to be efficient through the layer twos and right now we are speaking for couple hundred or couple thousand transactions uh, when we're going to have millions or even billions of transactions per day when actually for example uh, bitcoin or caspa or whatever currency will be global will have global adoption guys we will need to have uh, scalability on the mainnet because only in that way we can handle uh, all of these transactions without any problem okay right now maybe with layer twos we can have some more scalability with couple more thousands of transactions but it's not efficient for a global adoption and the answer here to for a global adoption is caspa guys caspa scalability because then the insane block creation is amazing it can handle absolutely a global adoption okay this is why caspa is the answer as you can clearly see bitcoin's lightning network usage is now down uh, 84 percent since last year and its capacity has plummeted by 15 percent over the last three months the lightning network can now only handle 5000 btc which is only the 0.000023 percent of bitcoin supplies maxis are dead silent about that and this is correct okay this is correct this is why i'm telling you that caspa is the answer we need scalability security and decentralization the only comparable project to caspa guys is bitcoin but bitcoin cannot scale that's why it have took the position of uh the store of value and it's gonna stay there okay you cannot scale the bitcoin uh even with the layer twos it can scale but not for a global adoption and let's move on to the last part of this video guys with wobi and coin market cap some people right now are actually doing a fight to uh, vote and to win this kind of a contest in uh, Huombi where actually they put here eight projects and one of these projects is Caspa and they said fight for the first seat to list on Huombi and people are actually right now the Caspa people I mean fight to list there and vote for Caspa uh, because guys they're saying that with uh, right now we've got two reliable exchanges and Huobi is a third reliable exchange because the coin market cap said okay, this is why I said that uh, these centralized companies are actually something that we don't want in the space we not, we would like the transparency we would like the fairness why that's why we are here and coin market cap is a centralized uh company which is owned by binance so as you understand these centralized authorities are putting the rules and we must follow the rules okay and to list properly when where we should be in coin market cap we should follow the rules of the coin market cap where they say for example to list in the proper position we will need to be in three reliable exchanges and they have a list of the exchanges that they trust okay uh, and we should actually uh, be in three of these exchanges to list properly which is crazy okay for me this is uh, insane this is something that um, shows me that coin market cap it's not reliable company it's not reliable as a site okay because obviously it's backed by binance and binance playing these dirty games so even binance for me it's not reliable exchange uh because we are here in this crypto space to have fairness okay we are moving from our current existing corrupted system global system bank system which is totally corrupted and we are moving into a world where we're looking for fairness transparency and all of these things 
and we are going straight into coin market cap where it's not reliable okay it's not actually fair they don't list uh, the coins where it, they should be because they are playing their games behind the screens something that we are very familiar with our current existed system so uh, personally i believe that we don't need hobby we don't need coin market cap uh, they're gonna list caspa even if it's not gonna be in these exchanges they're gonna list it because binance will buy after at some point caspa because they will need to buy caspa to be profitable okay they will need to have a very large portion of the max supply because they're gonna be super rich okay this is why we don't need them when people are gonna realize what caspa is they're gonna get fomo uh, exchanges will get FOMO, uh, big financial institutions will get FOMO, elites will get FOMO. When they're going to realize what CASPA is, they're going to get FOMO. Okay. And th they're going to buy crazy large amounts. Even right now, look at this. Uh, something that I also told you yesterday. Look at this. Coin, KuCoin, Mixi, and Get.io. Only these three exchanges got approximately 1 billion. 1 billion like in total 2 to 3 billion max supply it belongs to these three exchanges imagine what's going to happen when all exchanges and even bigger exchanges than these ones will invest in caspa guys they're going to buy like a minimum 2 billion each exchange where as you can clearly see the supply is the same we are about to see billionaires like michael seller buying a uh, crazy amount of billions of coins of caspa coins uh and as you understand the supply is fixed and that's gonna drive the price up okay it's all about demand and supply and when the supply is fixed and we won't actually have an increase in the supply like the fiat currency and we're gonna have the demand because that service the people the price will skyrocket into levels that is gonna shock the world okay that's why i believe we will reach 10 cents sooner than everyone thinks okay before the bull run of 2025 20, okay before even the bull run starts we're gonna reach the 10 cents so uh that's what i would like to tell you guys for those who ask me where you store your caspa the safest way guys the safest way for me is at the cold storage and the cold storage of my preference i believe this is the best one that you can choose is the tajem wallet okay after a heavy investigation in the cold storages i ended up to choose tajem and with the discount code crypto Chris, you're gonna have 10 percent discount or by clicking the link here you're gonna have this discount code imply, applied immediately so you won't have to put this crypto Chris code and um, i chose this tajem wallet over the others after heavy investigation that i did in cold storages and i was ex ledger user okay and after this uh, scandal that happened with the seed phrase uh, i immediately changed and i tried to find the next best cold storage and i ended up to choose tajem that's what i would like to tell you guys i hope you enjoyed the video let me know down below in the comment section if you have any question thank you so much for your support appreciate you for every like and every comment it means a lot to me and i will see you guys all in my next video until my next video your boy chris out bye